In recent years, spates of uncontrollable and destructive wildfires have become a global crisis. In Turkey, more than 100 wildfires erupted in late July. Fire crews have been battling day and night to bring the fires under control. Helicopters, planes and drones are being used in the efforts. Local volunteers and support teams are helping firefighters battle the flames. The blazes have also devastated parts of neighboring Greece and Italy. On the Greek island of Rhodes, many residents were left without electricity and water, and about a dozen homes were destroyed. In Italy, firefighters are still battling raging blazes that prompted officials to evacuate hundreds of people. The fires there have also destroyed a beach resort and forced the local airport to close. Even Russia's Yakutia region, one of the coldest places on earth, reported wildfires in the past month. In 2020, bushfires in Australia killed billions of animals and burned about 186,000 square kilometers of land. That same year, wildfires in the U.S. state of California burned more than 16,000 square kilometers of land. A recent U.S. Global Change Research Program report shows an increase in forest fire activity in recent decades. It points to warmer, drier conditions and increased drought as reasons for the spike. While some wildfires are caused by lightning strikes, researchers believe the majority are started by people. Wildfires have long been part of nature's cycle, but scientists say as the climate crisis accelerates, the frequency and intensity of those fires may become difficult to control.